New concerns this morning over rising tension in the region and the supply chain after increased attacks on cargo ships in the Red Sea. ABC's Lama Hassan joins us now from London with more. Lama, good morning. Yeah, good morning to you, Wit. Tensions are rising in the Red Sea. The U.S. warship, the USS Kearney, shooting down at least 14 unmanned drones on Saturday. Luckily, there was no damage to any of the ships in the area and no injuries were reported. And for the first time since the Gulf War in 1991, a British Royal Navy warship that had just arrived to boost security also destroying a separate suspected drone. The British Defense Secretary saying the target was commercial ships. Now, this is just the latest in a series of attacks in the Red Sea, which is one of the busiest and most important shipping lanes in the world. The drones are launched by Iranian-backed Houthi militants. And since Israel's war with Hamas has intensified, so too have the threats. The Houthis warning any vessels with links to Israel or sailing to and from Israeli ports will be attacked. The Houthis launching does Dozens of drones and missiles forcing at least four major shipping companies to pause their operations sailing through the Red Sea and at stake the global supply chain, including shipments of oil, grain and consumer goods, which, of course, could drive up prices and, of course, the real potential for a wider conflict. Gio. And that's the concern. All right, Lama, thank you so much for your reporting. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.